Baby dolls, Pulse Chain is going to pump with Ethereum. Have a look at this. Warning if you are in Soilana. Listen. Say that with a straight face, but I think it feels <laughs> that way, right? Solana was so consensus at token 2049 that it was scary. Like it was generally very, genuinely very scary. Everyone we met was bullish on the Solana ecosystem. Solana had their own conference. It went very well, but it was so consensus. I mean, token is more of like a Solana themed event, I would say, but no one was talking about Ethereum. It, it was fascinating. Well, let's look at. So, baby dolls, I am now here to tell you that mm, I'm having yummy, yummy protein yogurt. Look, Solana, it's priced in, bro. It's priced in. Okay. It's priced in. What does it's priced in mean? Let me show you. If you go, friends, to the Solana chart, I'm going to type in sol.d, okay? The Solana market cap dominance, okay? I know this chart just looks like it's going up forever. But I want to tell you something, all right? Firstly, you had that chick going, I'm with Solana, my girl, you're too poor to stay in Solana. I was like, well, okay, warning, warning, warning. But also, friends, I want to tell you something, man. In crypto, what you can do is go to like a monthly chart and you can check back how long it's buck been going up for. And what you'll find, friends, is like, Soilana, bro. Soilana, friends, has been going up for, my gosh, 12 months now. 12 months. In crypto, something that runs on for 12 months, that's usually the max roughly it can run for. Uh, there are some examples. Maybe they run for 13 or 14. Like You're, you're really, really, really gambling hard at that point. Now, I'm not saying it goes to zero, man. There's a lot of people and everything out here. I'm just telling you, bro, it's red ocean now. A blue ocean area is where there is low competition. It's blue. You're swimming with the fishies. No one's looking at where you are. It's easy to grab demand. Okay, it's easy to get excited. In a red ocean area, bloody waters, sharks everywhere. Okay, think about it like a business, friends. If you're going to start up a business and you say, hello, my friend, Sawi. Let's start up a business in the sports drinks field. And I'm like, bro, do you know how many sports drinks there are? 50 cents got one, vitamin, water, Coca-Cola, V's. Dude, just forget it. There's, there's way too many sports drinks. There's like 300,000 that are appearing out there. They're so tough. Like, you're an idiot if you pretty much try to get there. Your margin of error is like so, so, so thin. See, that's Red Ocean, friends. But what about if you wanted to start up in the year maybe 2015, a crypto exchange. <gasps> you see? Now, you can only look back in the benefit of hindsight, right? Because crypto ends up growing. If you're an exchange back then, you're in a blue ocean area, you see? So blue ocean, yeah, it could be risky, but there's no competition there. So, but, but it's about the mind frame. So right now, friends, when you're looking at Soilana, bro, you've been running for like 12 months up here, okay? Just to show you, okay? Look when I was long Soilana. Look how long it ran up for here, by the way. This is 12 months of the past. Okay, I was, I was long here, friends. This is, I made like 108x, I think 108. I think 100x or something on Soilana. And yeah, it ran up for 12 months. Okay, ran up for 12 months here on its dominance. You see, so it, it's been running up for 12 months again, man. That's all I'm saying. All right, it's been running up for 12 months. Just be careful when it comes to that. Like, you're like, dude, everyone's in. Every single mainstream influencer. What do they say? Top three coins to own. Bitcoin, Ethereum, Soilana. And now they've actually, they've thrown out the Ethereum part in there. They just put Sol. By the way, when someone does that, friend, just to let you know what they're actually doing. What they're basically saying is, what they're saying, friends, is they are long this chart. All right? They're long up here. So, like, how much upside have you got, bro? What, a 2x? Bro, you're going to flip Ethereum soon, Habib. Oh, maybe you do. Maybe you do. Maybe you're the unicorn. I don't know. I'm just telling you, bro. It's, it's risky to risk a big part of your ETH value for a freaking 2x. That's all I'm saying. I think you're risking a lot. This is the sole ETH ratio, okay? Now, it doesn't have to come back down to here, but, bro, Habib, these things, friends, they, they can do something like this where they just they go up, they come down, they, they, they screw around. You know what I mean? It can do something like that, man. And you think, oh, that doesn't look that bad. Look closer, my friends, okay? Look closer because from here, 
to like here is two to three years. I don't know. It doesn't look like that, but that, that can happen, man. That can happen. You just like, it's tough, man. It's tough. You can, it, I hope it all works out. Just like, look, man, if you, if you ever see a conference with your friends, Somi tokens being shield everywhere and everyone's saying it's consensus and everyone's saying, oh yeah, dude, <laughs> he's like the greatest thing ever, bro. Just, just sell me. Just get short on me. Just go get turbo leverage short on me. Okay, if you ever see that. Because I'll be priced in. So what's happening now, man? So, um, yeah, look, we know Ethereum's cheap, but now we want the slingshot leverage on Ethereum. That's Pulse Chain. And you know, Pulse Chain is mega cheap. Maybe you can get oh, slingshot leverage on that. I wonder. Well, that's all the altcoins in the ecosystem, isn't it? You see? Now, obviously, don't go throwing around all your money out there. 90% call 10% lottery, but you're in a blue ocean area, man. This is... This is Red Ocean, friends. This is Red Ocean. It's listed everywhere. Uh, everyone's shilling it. All the VCs. It's... Good luck. That's what I'm saying.